Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily reading for Wednesday, May 23rd. This is for all signs. This is what I'm picking up on for Wednesday, May 23rd. Keep in mind that energy is fluid, timing is fluid. We are all at different levels, you know. So this may be happening, may not be happening, you know, take it as it is. And if it doesn't resonate, then it wasn't meant for you. This is daily vibes, daily energy for Wednesday, May 23rd. Dear God, angels, universe, and spirits, what do we need to know today? <laughs> okay, so... We got the Wheel of Fortune coming out as a challenge, okay? So what that tells me is it's a challenge. Somebody, the destiny is, a change is on the horizon. Change is needed. The universe is, is nudging a change. They're pushing a change. They're wanting a change. It's destiny. There's a destined change on the horizon. Somebody is trying to stop it from happening. No, I don't want this change that is destined to be. I'm resisting this change. It's scary. It is. The Wheel of Fortune is a destined change. Right now, somebody is holding themselves back by not letting a cycle end so that a new one can begin. A new cycle is imminent. Why are you resisting it? King of Swords upright with the King of Cups reversed. Oh my goodness, okay. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, upright. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, reversed. Somebody needs to make a, a decision, a big decision. It's decision-making time. You're the judge, right? You're the judge. In one arena, there's lack of contentment. There's lack of communication. There's emotional withdrawal. There is... Emotional discontent. And now you are being called to be firm. And, and, and cut right through this. Cut right through this bull. Whatever it is. Make the decision that you need to make. Stop sitting on the fence. Stop letting your emotions hold you back. This is serious. The King of Swords is very decisive. Right to the point. Tells it like it is. Tell the truth. Just be honest. Do the right thing. The King of Cups reversed. Wants to escape the reality. 
And that's why this wheel is reversed. It's time for this change. It's time to do the right thing, but the reality of it is scary. Somebody knows they need to accept the reality of this change, but they're scared to. Hmm. It could be a choice between two people as well. You know, you need to follow your intuition. Follow your intuition on this one. When you go about making this final decision that's on the horizon, whether you like it or not, the wheel is spinning. It is. The wheel is spinning. When you go about making this decision, do it with your heart. Make this decision from your heart. Make sure that you are treating yourself with compassion. And that you're being treated with love. Somebody is feeling in one direction on this wheel. Somebody's not feeling loved. Why? Or they're not in love. Why would you stay in a situation where there's a lack of love? It's time for this cycle to, to, to start over, to end, okay? <laughs> not start over, to end. This is the last card in the deck. It, there's a, it, the world card is a lesson has been learned. You learned a lesson. That cycle, that phase, that time in your life is over. <laughs> and you can't stop it from happening. We evolve. This is the truth. The truth is here. The truth is here. And you cannot escape it as much as you would like to. The truth is out and you cannot escape it. And now it is time to step over that finish line and start the next phase. You have to take control of your life. It's time for you to master your emotions, seriously. Master your emotions, find that mental strength there's been a transformation. You have went through a transformation and that's why the wheel is spinning. Big changes have happened. And you can't escape the changes. A phase is over. That is the truth. That is the, the phase is over. That is the truth. You cannot escape it. It's time to move on. Master your emotions. Find the mental strength. Replace that fear with faith. And victory and success is right around the corner. You are headed towards, towards more victory and success than you even know. Six of Wands. The truth is out, the Ace of Swords. Use this power that you are being given wisely. Hold your head up high. Be confident. Be courageous. Go down this new path. You are being offered a new, the raw truth. You are. You're being offered the raw truth, the power to move into a new phase of your life right now. But it takes courage. 
and confidence and strength and focus and concentration to step into this unknown new cycle But that time in your life is over. It's over. This is the death of an idea, the Four of Swords. It's over. That phase of your life is over. Why are you clinging to it? Somebody's clinging to a phase when they know that it's over. There's no more happiness there. There's no more love. The foundation is no longer strong. Four is about foundations. They're both reversed. It's time to get your life back on track and head in the new direction towards victory and success, which is imminent. There's been a transformation here. Find the courage and the strength to... To accept these changes in, that you can't escape. But you cannot escape as much as you'd like to. Somebody it needs to replace that fear with confidence. Once you accept this truth that leads you down this new beginning towards success. There's a lot of success here. Success, success, success. Consider that last phase a success. It was a lesson you needed to learn along this journey. Whatever phase I'm talking about in your life was a success, even if it sucked. It taught you something. And now it's time for you to start another one in which you're scared to start because you don't know the reality of it. It's scary to step into the unknown. But you're being called to head in a new direction with this chariot card. This one too. You're being called to head in a new direction with confidence and courage and faith. Because where you're at, there's no more growth. And that is the damn truth. So I feel like today is a day of standing up and making the decision to stop escaping this change that is happening. find the courage to accept it find the courage to accept the truth that is being offered to you about this new beginning that is like I said earlier way back at the beginning of this reading there's more victory and success than you even know if you could find it in yourself to love yourself enough to move forward you know when you don't feel comfortable with yourself and you don't love yourself you don't have confidence in yourself and you can't move forward I mean I could keep going but I'm not going to there's a new opportunity here for victory and success down a whole new path that you can't see you can't see the outcome but you're being called to take that step anyway. Take that step. Stop trying to escape the truth. Escape the truth. One phase is over. It's done. Just let it go. Move on. You be the master of your emotions and head on out. We're going to get you one of these. I'm not going to look while I'm shuffling because there's stuff on both sides. So if one falls out, I'll know it. 
This is for Wednesday, May 23rd. It's a day of hearing the truth, seeing the truth, accepting the truth, speaking the truth, mm -hmm. and stepping into the unknown without fear. And who can do that, right? <laughs> Only the strongest person can do that. Here it is. Ooh, relaxation. Allow yourself to be lazy. It's okay to do nothing. This card right here is a, a card of rest and relaxation and recuperation as well. After something ends, you need to take a time out. So maybe you just need to take time to accept the reality of this change. And that could certainly be the case. This change is here, whether you like it or not. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take this card to heart. I wouldn't. It is okay to do nothing once in a while. But if you continue to escape it like this guy is, this guy is being lazy. There's no doubt. It will only hinder your victory and success. So I, I would say that it's okay to take a day. Maybe today is the day that you realize that something is truly over and you're about to start a new huge phase. I'm not kidding. This is huge. You are about to start a big new phase long term. A long-term phase. Seriously, you are. You're about to start a new long-term phase in your life that leads to a lot of happiness and victory and success. And maybe today is the day where it all comes to light and you realize that you can't escape this truth. And you may just need to take this day to contemplate these changes that are, that are happening whether you like it or not. So anyway, the challenge for the day is resisting this new cycle. There, this wheel is spinning and somebody is scared to death. So my advice is to find that courage and that confidence to head down that new road with your head held high. Accept the truth. Something has ended. A phase in your life has ended. And, and a huge new one is beginning. Talk to you later.